Hi, my name is Ashish and in this video we will see how to monitor the published APIs in Azure API Management Instance. So let me just quickly log on to the portal and take it from there. I'm inside the portal and if you would see the, if you want to view the metrics of your APIs, so API Management emits metrics every minute, giving the real time visibility into the state and health of the APIs and it it handles the capacity, total gateway re request, successful gateway request, failed gateway request, unauthorized gateway request, and other kind of request as well. So if you would, if you are under your uh, management section, and if you would see the monitoring options, here it is. Click on metrics, maybe later. This is your metrics from the drop down, and uh, if you would <coughs> go. Third dropped click on the dropped event hub so these are the different metrics that you might be interested in to check for uh, this APIs and the chart also would show the number of the API calls the chart can be filtered using the dimensions of the request metric you want to if you want to set up an alert rule for the unauthorized access so just click on the alert option here click on the new alert rule this is the resource that we are adding a resource alert for then you can add the condition here signal type let it come up go for metrics go for unauthorized gate where it's depreciated wow. duration of the backend request over the last six hours aggregated click on done here threshold value one one minute aggregation granularity period defines the interval over which data points are grouped using the aggregation type function Frequency of evaluation every one minute you can set it as per your needs click on done The action group name action group allows you to define actions at scale Do it later alert detail severity 3 alert rule name test here It will create a new alert rule an action group would let you select the name of the action group wherein the email notification would be sent to. You click on refresh if you do not see your result. My alert rule has been created. Okay, nice. And if you want to access the activity logs in your API, you can any time go on to the top click on activity log here this is the activity logs this is all what we uh, you know, which would show the logs of what is the activity like of your api management services and the diagnostic logs provide the rich information about operations and errors that are important for auditing as well as troubleshooting purposes and if you would want to configure the diagnostic logs you can right in here under monitoring section you see the diagnostic settings you want to add a diagnostic setting click on here you want to name a diagnostic settings name it like in test you can archive to this to storage account send it to log analytics send it to stream event hub this is how you enable the monitoring on your API management services. You can play around with all of these options as per your needs. And if you have any queries, please mention them in the comment section. I hope you like this video. I see you guys in the next video. Thank you. Have a great day ahead. Bye bye.